even if I get cosmetic surgery and I come out with a full head of hair, long arms, the best looking guy in the world, that's not the real me. It's fake. If I get cosmetic surgery and come out perfect, still, if you take a cell from the new perfect quote unquote me, the clone me would still be the ugly me I was and am now before the cosmetic surgery. And this is why I wish it was possible for genetic, genetic engineering to actually change my DNA. This is why I'd rather to grow a cocoon around me and undergo a metamorphosis like you're about to see and come out with the longer arms, the hot looks, the whole fat head full of hair, everything I want. And it would be the real me. If we took a cell from this new me and cloned it, it would come out the real me. She, as a little girl, as a runt, Suppose eight years old. You keep the innocent safe. And when I'm president of the United States, she's going to America. And especially those Americans who have not known safety. My God, it's a what? It's very, very And it's so beautiful. Wait a minute. No, we can't interfere right now, Robert. Whatever this process is, she's going through. We have to let it run its course. Or she could be damaged, may even die. That's my hand reaching out from the new me, reaching out for my soul. I'm coming to my body that my body can be what I am in my soul and my mind and my spirit. Oh my God. The, the new me. Out comes a beautiful top notch super healthy Woman, full grown woman. You want more money? You need cash. Subscribe with that stash me up in a flash. Reach out and grab it. I wish it was. I wish it was scientifically possible to under for, for me to undergo same kind of metaphoric morphosis to take this old rickety, decrepit, sickly body, encase it in a cocoon, and you can see the wrinkles, the retardation, the ugliness, boil away. Out would come a young looking, looking 19 years old, Hot looking, sexy as hell. Healthy in every way possible. Me. Still me in my mind. Still loving who I love, who I love, thinking how I think. With the perfect body so that I can eat like a pig, sleep like a baby, run like an athlete, fight like a martial artist, and they had to, we had the long arms and long forms the both this girl's forms. It literally makes me sit to my stomach. See these good looking girls with their long arms. And to know that their arms, their forms, their elbow to wrists are longer than mine. That mine arm not longer than theirs. That really, 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 really makes me sick. I feel like the gold medal, I feel like the Olympic won silver instead of the gold. 
and it makes life what's the point of living life when you are unhappy I can only hope that is a, it, not only is it possible but that soon I can get the laser or bone stripping techniques to stress my arms and my arms will still be as good as they are now so that I can have longer more sumptuous bigger arms than they got even then I still arms are only longer than them because I cheated and this is why I wish it was possible for genet genetic en engineering to actually change my DNA this is why I'd rather the grow a cocoon around me and undergo a metamorphosis and come out with the longer arms, the hot looks, the whole fat head full of hair, everything I want. And it would be the real me. Able to think crystal clearly with the IQ that of Einstein. And it would be the real me. For at least 20, 30 years, 30 years before I would start to grow old like everybody else. Shit. I feel like I'm a pass out with a fucking headache. I could not find anywhere on that internet the guy that has a look that cl matches closest to what I look like in my mind, in my heart, in my soul. But the look, the good look I want, the hot top notch look I want is that of a boyish look. Soft look. Boyish, not manly. A hot look. At the same time, a look that the females will see that they will want to hug me. Not because I'm hot, but because I exude something that makes them feel compassion for me. Tenderness. Kind a, a kindness. Being, quote unquote, sick as hell. A look that makes me, that makes me hot to the college age girls. The girls 27 and younger. The high school girls and even the younger girls admire me from afar. Oh, he's so fine. <laughs> he's so hot. He's so fine. If the pre pre the 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 girls don't think you're hot, you're not hot because they're the pickiest ones of all. But the ones I want to come up to talk to me are the college age girls. And an occasional high school girl who mis mistakes me for being 19, 18. And no, I don't want their sex. I just want their thinking that I'm a hot guy. And after that, the, the occasional the girl who comes up to talk to you because they cannot stand it looking at you. They, they cannot stand it. They just got to come up and talk to you. That's what I want. And the rest of you guys out there, you can have all the sex. I don't want that. I don't give a damn about having sex. I feel like I want to pass out now. Why shouldn't I just kill myself? I feel like I want to pass out now. Why shouldn't I just kill myself? I would come out of that cocoon, able to rap and sing, about the best, just think, you see me up here on stage, I got stage presence, just imagine if I was a guy that I see myself being in my mind, if you saw this same guy up on stage doing what my ugly body is doing now, it wouldn't be long before I would be getting the record deal from a major label and do this on stage on international TV. If I was a good looking guy, in my mind, I could rule the world.